We got to hit the Nike Under Armour Wars and how at one point this offseason it was looking like they might infect the Warriors locker room. This started a couple weeks back when Kevin Durant joined Bill Simmons podcast on The Ringer. Durant said he didn't go to the University of Maryland because he wanted to go to a Nike school. This was the quote. Nobody wants to play in Under Armour. Uh-huh. Of course, Steph Curry, not only one of Under Armour's biggest endorsers, he has a stake in the company. And yesterday, he spoke to his hometown paper, the Charlotte Observer, telling Scott Fowler the comment bothered him enough, he and Durant, quote, had to have a conversation about it. Steph also told Fowler that looking at Under Armour's growth, KD's statement, quote, does not ring true at all. Still, this is the key. He repeated this one twice. This is nothing that is going to put a wrench in the locker room. I mean, Byron, I think fans would be surprised how much these shoe wars and the behind the scenes sort of shoe controversies do affect players, right? Yeah, these guys take this very personable. You know, this is this is serious business. But I think Steph has about 50, 60, 70 million dollar reasons <laughs> to wear <laughs> Under Armour. Under I mean, shoes. you know, and, and, and KD, I think when he said this is more of a jokingly way of saying it, you know, just probably throwing a little jab at him. I don't see this being a big issue when it's all said and done. This is not something that's going to ruin these guys from trying to win another championship. They'll probably talk about it, discuss it. Now, this would be a funny part, Mark. One day in practice, you know, that, that little armor all shoe or even KD's Nike, it breaks apart. Mm. Guess who's going to be giving each other some digs then? Mm -hmm. You know, so I don't think this is going to be a big deal. I think they'll let it go. See, he didn't bring up anything about sweatshops or nothing like that from the early 90s. Like, he should have, he could have came back with him. Steph, I'm used to Steph being more whimsical than that, you know, a little bit, a little, a little teasing back. But sometimes I think, you know, KD has been real, keep it real. Every year, it seems like increasingly more yes. as he gets older. I think keeping it real kind of went wrong here. Um, <laughs> just, just a little bit. Uh, your co star has special, ownership like in the country. And, you know, <laughs> they didn't talk about uh, Clay's Anta shoes, you know, right. leave him alone in it. But well, uh, I'm glad they talked it out. We know that Nike was very happy when KD went to the Warriors to yeah. sort of get some Nike branding on that team because Steph Curry had dominated it with so much Under Armour branding. Yeah. The stuff is real. But the didn't Under Armour help raise KD's money yes, in this contract? Yes, they did. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. This is all, it's, mm -hmm. it's all there, people, right below the surface. It's all happening.